Hey everybody, Relic Ready here. Um, as you can see, I'm outside. I uh, I just wanted to find out if, and well, basically the long story short, um, it's spring. It's starting to look like it. So, <laughs> as you can see, there's uh, quite a few spots. Uh, basically, a long time ago, ran around here somewhere. So there used to be an ant mountain, and I managed to get rid of it by using just uh, old old coffee grinds and uh, buckets, uh, buckets of water. Um, the other reason why I'm out here is because of something of a, a little labor of love that uh, I've been wanting to do for years and I'm finally able to do it um, of a trial and error. I've finally, last year around uh, October I planted uh, daffodils and tulips right before the uh, frost had even started. It was kind of like the last few days of uh, actual warm weather we had before the uh, fall had actually kicked in in full, full gear. So uh, I came right around after work. I went for a peek and I was quite surprised to see what I saw and uh, found saw a little something even more that I didn't expect coming. So uh, without further ado, let's just take a look, shall we? <clears throat> Now I'm just trying to get this into focus. So, yeah. <laughs> I'll just switch hands here. All right. So, let's just get down as close as I can. So I planted like some daffodils, like tulip, daffodil, tulip. I guess I got the daffodil a little bit too close, but you get the idea. Oh shoot, you can't quite see. Um, it's not really easy getting in the angle right, but you can see what I mean. Tulips, daffodils, tulips, daffodils. Uh, there's a, I don't know, I thought I planted stuff here, but I guess it didn't I guess I just kind of wanted to put something right here originally, so I'll figure that out when I want to grow there. Um, let's see here, keep on going. And looky right here, I got crocuses. Right here. That was something I was not expecting at all. I mean, that was a, that did not show up last year, or at least I don't know. But hopefully, I can probably transplant them and get them closer to the uh, closer right over here. That's kind of the hope and plan, but. Uh, I hope when it comes to the first time we uh, get our uh, lawn cut <coughs> that I can save these babies beforehand. I'm so freaking proud of what I've been able to do so far, so. Yeah, that's my little uh, garden, gar my little garden uh, vlog for the day. Um, <sighs> years in the making and I finally get some progress. Last year, around this time of year, I actually planted um, uh, potatoes and I only got like 25 miniature ones and uh, all of a sudden one huge one the size of my hand. Like, yeah, that big. <laughs> so that was pretty, quite something. Um, I'll probably just wait for it to warm up a little bit before I transfer mm, trans transfer these babies, because uh, those... Uh, the uh, crocuses, I just, like I said, I that was a surprise I wasn't expecting, so, yeah, and, ooh, I see another daffodil trying to peek out. I cannot wait for these dim babies to bloom, so I'm just looking forward to this. Anyway, um, <laughs> that's my first gardening vlog of the year. Hopefully I might do another one if people like what they see, and uh, eventually I will be doing a video of, um, <clears throat> of my uh, Winter Soldier arm that I'm currently doing. Uh, I just need to figure out, to get the, figure it out. Um, I'm, I'm getting help from a friend of mine that uh, I met a long time ago. I'll explain later in that video sometime, but uh, once I get it all figured out and uh, started, um, hopefully that it will be soon. So that'll be, soon. like I said, that'll be soon, but uh, we're not right now at this moment because it's starting to get a little cold out here. <laughs> anyway, 
If I don't see you, happy Easter and all that other good, good stuff. Bye-bye.